Hello, my creative friends. Olga Sobi here and welcome to another acrylic pouring video. I hope you're doing great and you know what? Early October is one of my most favorite times of the year because right now is the time when some trees dress up in such beautiful, vibrant autumn outfits. And today I feel very inspired by this warm and cozy fall palette. So I want to create the acrylic pour painting using some of these colors and I also want to combine it with the black and white color base, the split color base. So let's see how that's gonna turn out. Let's get started. I'm working on 12 by 24 canvas today and first I'm gonna apply my black and white base. Let's try to go for this shape. I like when there is a little wave between black and white or any other color split, split colors. My secret message. My black and white base is done, so next I like to torch the air bubbles that's in the paint. Okay. And I'm gonna add colors to my funnel. I'm using the silicone funnel by Lolly Wave today. And it's the same brand as I have the silicone mat on my table. I have a 10% discount for all the products from this uh, brand, so if you wanna check it out, I'm gonna include all the information in the description under this video. My colors are all set and ready to go. I like to think through the order of my colors before I add them to the funnel. And there is no silicone in any of my colors. So I feel like I wanna add a touch more white here. Okay. So I'm pr probably gonna uh, do a several rounds of each color. So I'm adding just a little color at the time and I probably would need to fill up the whole funnel this is probably more than enough I think I am done with adding colors. This should be enough. And now let's do the travel. I'm gonna prepare my white on the side here in case I need some more. And let's go. white a few more times. I just really like the effect it creates when colors blend slowly from white to a more bright color. Okay, let's give it a torch. I want to add a few swipes, maybe just on the white side for now. Oh, open some of that green. I'm 
not sure if I'm gonna do any more, but for now, uh, I'm taking my favorite tool, the metal straw, and now I'm gonna blow this paint and move it around a little. And for the direction of the flow, I think I want it all to be that way because I actually feel like this is gonna be the top. At least this is how I think about it right now. This is how I feel it right now. So I want to have the uh, up going movement in this piece. I added a few more swipe here on the bottom because I feel like I want to bring more weight uh, to the black section to balance out the top. All right, let's play with this part. Dance of autumn leaves in the loving arms of western wind. This is what I see in this piece. Wow, I am in a romantic mood today, <laughs> right? But I really like how the funnel technique allows all the colors interact with each other as they go through the stem of the funnel, but at the same time, they do not overmix too much, though, so there, there is no mud here. And all these parts look so much like leaves and I love that. And of course, black and white base always creates so much contrast. I just love it. I love how it makes the colors pop and stand out. And even having quite a bit of negative space does not look empty just because black balances out the white. Well, I have to say I'm happy with this piece. So now let me bring you for the close up. Please let me know how you like the outcome and how you like the name idea or maybe that would be too long for the idea but do you see what I see or what do you see? <laughs> Thank you so much for watching as always. Happy pouring and see you next time. Bye bye and have an awesome day.